fatigue, depression, anxiety, sensitivity to light, sound, and smell, mood swings, memory issues, extremely suicidal, hallucinating at work, panic inside, sweaty hands, but they're freezing, body pains, my chest compressed. Oh man, I'm not feeling too great. That's my life in the medicine's hands. All this talk in the media about the opiates and still not the benzodiazepines. Ativan, Xanax, everybody's on this today. People don't realize when they're given benzodiazepines what's going to come of it in the end. I'm gonna take my first of four clonopins right now. What's up, dude? With the anxiety, it affects my life every day. No one ever once mentioned the clonopin. I've been through it. I'm gonna help you through it. After about five years of panic attacks, I began to work with a psychiatrist. He gave me these pills. When they're working, which they do at first, it was a relief. Where things went wrong is when I tried to stop. Heart palpitations, digestive issues, insomnia, feels like my teeth are being electrified. All that stuff going on at once. There's this scientific narrative at odds with the public narrative. Once you go to the raw science, you find the drugs aren't nearly as effective as they say. They have a lot more adverse effects. You find long-term studies, and you see people on medications doing worse. So there's a monetary story behind this as well. I may as well be dead. I can't do anything with my life anymore. There's Scotty right there. That's what we miss, that we don't have right now. Pharma influence guidelines with little attention to the long-term consequences. New legislation relative to benzodiazepines. The bill will put restrictions on prescribing of benzodiazepines. I was told that since I took it as prescribed, Ativan was harmless. It's a global problem. 45 people attended today. It's just such a shame that more hasn't been done. I understand that it is asking a lot to concede that numerous top experts may be incorrect, but that is exactly what is happening. I just feel really anxious for no reason. My life is horrible. Every year that goes by, there's going to be more people and more tragic until we can put a stop to this. It's not that I don't have anxiety or should have help. I was given the wrong help. <laughs>